it going guys Sherlock's here welcome back to a quick Roblox news video actually to be fair I don't know how long this video is going to be maybe I'll add some new news topics into it while I'm editing I guess we are going to get straight into this one since I have some very interesting topics to cover the first one is over on the Roblox website and it's all about the upcoming Roblox Lobu carnival event well something kind of funny happened with this event one of the developers behind it or the person that's creating it accidentally left the game open so it was public and anyone could play it for a few minutes so let's go and take a look at the event let's see how many people played it and let's see if anyone got the prizes here's the event guys lobu mystery box hunt testing i know it says testing in the game's title but nope this is not actually the test server this is actually the official event game by roblox.cn a big event will begin on august 20th i've made videos about this already i'm sure 99 percent of you watching know what this is anyway what happened is 17 hours ago this game was actually opened but it was opened by accident and 5,691 people ended up playing it. There is actually one person playing it right now but that's a developer so let me show you guys all of the damage. It looks like a load of people got the welcome badge. Maybe they got this and then were quickly kicked. I don't know. It looks like some people got some of like the box prizes so like get the hidden reward. Two people got this one. Open one mystery box. 700 people got this one. A couple of people actually managed to get some of the prizes. A flower for hunter. 11 people managed to get this one and the arthro packages three people got this one and four people got the elf character that is really funny this event was accidentally opened and loads of people managed to play and got the badges now yeah to be honest about the prizes i don't actually know if these people got the prizes or not of course we can tell they got the badges of course we can tell the event was opened by accident and loads of people were playing apparently there was like 200 people playing at once i guess these guys won't be making the same mistake twice i went over to youtube i went over to twitter i tried to find videos of people getting the prizes or like screenshots but I couldn't exactly find anything so I know for a fact that people did manage to get badges about the prizes I'm not too sure it doesn't really matter to be honest because this event will open in three days anyway Roblox Lobu did actually post some more information over on their QQ website if we just scroll down past the Barbie Afro character I did try to translate it to English but it didn't exactly work very well anyway if we scroll down we can see some of the prizes so yeah we've got the clown we've got the Arthro packages. I'm not going to go through everything because I've already covered this like so many times. But there you go. You can get Kidneyser if you want to. All right, guys. So in other news, many of you have been requesting and asking me to talk about this. This is like a Roblox error, which many, many people are having. I've been getting so many tweets about this. So it's about time I cover it in a Roblox news video. And this news is an error that some people are getting. When they try and play Roblox, it comes up saying your connection is not private and they can't seem to access the website. So let's take a closer look at the error. It's happening on Google Chrome, Firefox and other web browsers as well. It comes up saying your connection is not private. Attackers might be trying to steal your information from www.roblox.com, for example, passwords, messages or credit cards. Learn more and it also gives us a second error which says net ERR cert authority invalid. Now what that means is the Roblox certificate is not valid. Each website has a certificate so you know when you go to a website and it's HTTPS. Every website you use should be encrypted this way. Well, Roblox says it's not secure. So it's basically not running HTTPS, which is obviously a glitch or it's an error. Roblox should be fixing this fairly soon. But for some reason, I've been getting messages like this all day. Even now, I even got a message about this like 10 minutes ago. So I guess Roblox haven't fixed this yet. Now, for you guys that are getting this error message, there might be a few ways to fix it. Now, honestly, I think Roblox is probably going to fix this because I'm guessing it's Roblox as fault. To be honest, I highly doubt that thousands of people would encounter this bug on the same day. So I'm guessing this is probably Roblox's fault and they probably need to fix something. But here's what you can try to fix it. So there's like four steps you can try. Number one, make sure the date and time on your computer is correct. Number two, click on advanced, then click proceed to website. Maybe that will work. Number three, type in the secret code on your keyboard. And the secret code is this is unsafe. No spaces. Type that in, see if the website loads. And the fourth one is use a new browser until this is fixed. So you could try Firefox or Edge or Opera. Any of this stuff should be okay. So yep, a new Roblox error that says your connection is not private and you can't browse the website. I'm hoping Roblox can fix this very, very soon. Moving on to other news. This one is from an official Roblox account, Roblox Developer Relations. They said our Roblox security team is hosting an event to share best practices for securing your accounts plus tips on how to stay safe online. I guess so many people are getting hacked on 
Roblox. They're basically telling people like how to stay safe, how to like secure their Roblox accounts and all of that kind of stuff. To be honest, guys, I don't know who can join this. Staying safe online from Wednesday the 18th of August. Best practices on tips on keeping your account safe on Roblox. I think it's like a Zoom call or something like that. So surely not many people can join, but I guess it's kind of interesting. Maybe this is open to developers. I guess most developers kind of know how to protect their accounts, but at least Roblox are trying to do something. Got a tweet here from a guy called Hype Shadow. He said, hey Russo. So he sent his tweet to Russo Plays. He said, this video just got uploaded. It's by Jerome ASF Roblox. Just so you know, it looks very similar to yours and wanted to let you know. So basically what's happening is Jerome ASF is copying other Roblox YouTubers. I'm guessing it's his thumbnail creator. But then again, the video is also very accurate. So yeah, that's a bit scummy. I don't know why this guy is copying people's thumbnails. But yeah, hopefully he stops doing this because that's not a very nice thing to do. Got an interesting tweet here from Bloxy News. They said Roblox has enabled a new property for image labels and image buttons in Studio called Resample Mode. Basically what this lets you do is make GUI images like higher quality. I guess it kind of turns them into like pixel art. And to be honest, that is really cool. So if you wanted to upload very small images as like game buttons or icons inside of a game, then you can actually enable this and you can make the icons look a lot nicer. Got some news about Roblox purchasing a company. Yes, Roblox did actually end up buying a Discord clone and this Discord clone is called Gilded. To be honest, I've never heard of this. I did actually look this thing up. I did watch some like setup tutorials on YouTube and yeah, this thing is definitely a copy of Discord. Okay, to be fair, I don't know what came first. Was it Gilded? Was it Discord? But this thing is very, very similar. Anyway, Gilded tweeted out saying, we are excited to announce that Team Gilded has been acquired by Roblox. So yep, Roblox purchased this company. What is Roblox going to do with this company? Honestly, I'm not too sure. I guess now Roblox is actually competing with Discord. That's kind of mad. On Gilded's official website, joining Roblox by Eli, we're excited to announce that we've been acquired by Roblox and that will be continuing on our mission with more resources and support than ever before. So yeah, that's kind of mad. Roblox is buying so many companies. They bought Loom AI last year. They bought some other stuff as well. I can't remember everything they've bought, but they've been buying a lot. Got a tweet here from 0929lego and he said, shirts. This guy is a UGC creator for Roblox, but he ended up trying to make some 3D clothing and they actually came out looking really cool. Let's just have a quick look at all of these because I thought these looked really nice. If Roblox UGC creators ever get the chance to make their own 3D layered clothing, then this is definitely what they will end up looking like, especially the ripped jeans. Like that looks so sick, especially like on these normal Roblox characters as well. Yeah, that looks really, really cool. I really like how these turned out. This guy is definitely good at creating 3D stuff. Here's a tweet from Scully. To be fair, 3D layered clothing actually looks really good over on Roblox characters. Not the Afro characters though, the classic characters. On Afro, it looks kind of terrible, but on classic characters, I think this looks awesome. Here we have some news from the official Roblox account. Yet another milestone that wouldn't be possible without our amazing community. Thank you so much for helping us hit 3 million followers on Twitter. So yep, Roblox reached 3 million followers on Twitter. And in the past, guys, we have had Twitter promo codes. We had like the tweet Roblox. We had some shades. I think we had some other stuff as well. I can't remember everything. I'll put a picture of them on screen for sure. So since Roblox hit 3 million followers over on Twitter, that is a lot of followers. Does that mean that Roblox is going to give away another free promo code accessory? I mean, possibly. That'd be pretty cool. They did tweet about it with a love heart. So yes, that does mean that they are aware that they hit this milestone. Maybe they would give something away to the community. That'd be pretty cool. But Roblox didn't just hit a milestone on Twitter. They also hit a milestone over on TikTok. One from Roblox RTC. Roblox's TikTok account is crushing it with over 6 million followers. They got 6 million followers on TikTok. Double what they had on Twitter. That is a lot of followers. That is insane. Another TikTok promo code? Maybe. A bit of classic news from RBX News. On this day 14 years ago, Roblox introduced Builders Club, which later got replaced by Roblox Premium. Damn, 14 years ago today. RIP Builders Club. I honestly really liked that subscription service. You got free hats. It was pretty sick. Leave a like on this video if you remember Builders Club. And there we have it, guys. Another episode of Roblox News. I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. And if you did, let me know by leaving a like on the video. Also, subscribe if you are new. Thank you so much for 900k subscribers. That is insane. We are now on the road to 1 million subscribers. If you guys could help me reach that goal, make sure to click the subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you
you guys in the next one.